Welcome to another In Like Flynn's Beer Review. I'm here tonight with my good friend, Chris Burns. Now, you might have seen Chris from some of my hiking videos and our Yosemite video. We go a lot of fun places together. Like so, breweries. Yeah, we, we love going to breweries. Like, we've been to so many breweries in Maryland and Pennsylvania, it's not even funny. Um, so, today, Chris brought over a new brew. What do we got here? Got a UFO... UFO Maine Blueberry. All right. UFO Maine Blueberry. Uh, so what is the brewery on this? Is it UFO? Let me see. Real I quick. guess UFO. UFO Beer Company. I guess they're out of Maine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's an think. interesting name. So it says a refreshingly subtly sweet blueberry ale. So it's a blueberry ale. Yep. 4.8% alcohol by volume. I wonder if it's got the IBUs on here. I'd say they've been a craft brewery since 98. Anyway, this is what we're going to be drinking tonight. All right, Chris, that's your beer. You do the honor, sir. All right, set us up. Sounded good. Oh, it smells... I can already smell the blueberry, actually. Yeah, they say on the card, the reading card, that uh, you're going to think you picked it right out of the field. This already... So, um, we have a brewery close to our house called Red Brick Brewery, and they have the best blueberry ale I have ever had. It only comes out in the spring, so we're actually going to get ready for some blueberry ale this year. Um, and already, just the aroma of yeah. this ale reminds me of the blueberry at Red Brick. smell it. Yeah. All right. Cheers. cheers. Let's give it a go, man. That does have a blueberry. It does. You can, yeah. It's hard because I want to compare it to Red Brick because Red Brick makes such a good blueberry ale. I could totally see myself drinking this in the summertime, though. Like, the aftertaste I, is more blueberry than it is when you're actually drinking yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You taste it more after the fact. Now, Yeah, up front, you don't get a ton of the blueberry up front. It just tastes like a normal, like, ale or even like a lager, but then it really hits you afterwards. Right. UFO main blueberry. 4.8. Yeah, it's definitely light. I mean, this is a summer beer that I could see sitting down and, and knocking a couple back. I really like it. I really like this beer. That's an easy one to finish. What's it on the scale? How are we going to rate it? I don't know. What do you you think? know, so this is our first beer review. Um, many more to come, I believe, trust me. Um, one to five. On a scale of five. Dude, I'm giving this... Mm, uh, I don't want to be it's too same picky. Same time. Ready? Same time. Same time. Well, we're going to knock this back. Give me your rating. All right. One, two, three... Four. Four. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> All right. We have similar taste. And that's the UFO main blueberry. 4.8%. Yeah. percent Rating four. Out this was five. good. Mm -hmm. Where did you get this? Did you get this Total Wine? Total Wine. So I don't know, wherever you guys are watching this, I don't know if Total Wine is a chain around the country, but around us, Total Wine is literally like the Walmart of liquor stores. It's like a department store. Yeah. Of you, everything. You literally go in with a cart, and it's literally like the size of a small Target. Just any kind of alcohol, liquor, wine, beer that you want. I'm sorry, I'm not actually trying to plug them. I'm not and getting any kind of endorsement. Oh, that's right. They do. They have got like the cigar room in yeah. there. Yeah. It's That's the place to go, and you Cooler. can find stuff like from <clears throat> everywhere. So... And you can buy loose beers and build a six pack. Is that what you did? You bought it. You yeah, put you together buy a six pack. Things you want to try. Nice. I would if I found that in the store, I would totally get some, especially for the summer. I, I got to say, I do like Red Bricks Blueberry a little bit better. That that was. Yeah. We should review that. And they put real blueberries in there. So. Yeah. Well, you could totally you can do that with blueberry in here. It'll bounce up and down. All right. Well, here we go. Um, thanks for watching. We hope that you enjoyed our little review video. Uh, we would love it if you like and subscribe to our channel. And I promise there's going to be more beer reviews with my man, Chris, here. <laughs> Thank you so much, Chris. Right. 
All right, I think we got to crack open another one and do another review, man. I know. All right, peace I'm out. out.